In medical news tonight, a new experimental treatment for cancer is being used in New York for the very first time. Seven's on call with Dr. Jay Ellisberg to show us how chemo, how hot it is and how it works. Sade, Diana, this is a treatment for cancer patients who have no chance of long-term survival because the cancer has spread to the abdomen. It's done in the operating room and the drug liquids are heated first. It can mean a longer survival. How are you doing? Oh, tired. Marjorie Myers is at her doctor's office to receive ongoing treatment for ovarian cancer, which has spread through her abdomen. It was filling her belly with fluid. I was uh, miserably uncomfortable and uh, actually starting to huff and puff because I guess it was pressing on my lungs. And of course, it made it very difficult to eat. And uh, I imagine it's the way you feel when you're nine months pregnant. But Ms. Myers had this major operation in late September where doctors circulate hot chemotherapy solution all through the abdomen. Without the heat, the technique doesn't work. With it, a major advance, says Dr. Atia. If you put all tumors in the abdomen together, you're talking about 20 to 30 percent, 20 to 25 percent five-year survival, which, in fact, was zero before this procedure. Patients with any type of cancer with spread to the abdomen can be treated, including colon, ovarian, and stomach cancers. The abdomen is flushed twice with chemotherapy solution, the first time for about an hour at a high concentration, the second time one half an hour at a low concentration. The temperature both times about 105 degrees Fahrenheit. There are plenty of risks, post-op fever, post-op abdominal infections, and a death rate as high as 8%. But Marjorie is no longer short of breath. Her appetite and her sleep are better. Because ovarian cancer is something that you, you only a very lucky few get rid of completely, this is a procedure that will buy a lot of women many, many years of comfort and possibly even a cure. Candidates for this treatment must undergo tests to show that the tumor is confined to the abdomen.